You want to know how to make violet and dandelion jelly? Find out with me. So first of all, I've got the dishwasher running. It's got all our jars and lids in there, and I'm gonna sanitize those in the dishwasher, okay? And then, I have had the dandelions and violets from my front yard steeping in water for, I think about a week. Um, I used hot water, let them sit in it for a few hours just until they cooled off enough that I could put them in the fridge. And then as you see right there, I covered it with the, the, the cling wrap, the plastic, like really sticks super well to stuff. Um, and I just now took them out of the fridge um, where I've kept them for the past week. So we're gonna strain them now. Got my setup here, got the strainer inside this jar. I'm gonna strain it and I'll be right back. Okay, you can see we got a lot of tea there. Now we're gonna strain the flowers. I already squeezed out these flowers in the bowl. I'm just gonna squeeze out what's in the strainer because you wanna get every last bit of goodness that you can out of that. And you don't have to let them steep for as long as I did. I've just been super busy with like work and doctor appointments for myself and the kids and all kinds of stuff. All right, pour the tea into a pan. Try not to spill like that just did. So now I'm going to bring that tea to a boil in my pan. When that is boiling, I'm going to put the low sugar pectin into the pan, stir it in well, and then I'm gonna bring it back to a boil and add another, um, I'm gonna add something else. I'm gonna add about three cups of sugar at most. Um, it depends on if you want it like super sweet or not. I don't like it super sweet. So I'm just gonna do probably about three cups of sugar. And then I'll boil it for one more minute after all of that combines and we will have our jelly to pour into our um, jars. And I'm gonna do the same thing to make a beautiful red bud jelly. I'm so excited to show it to you guys. Look at that beautiful rolling boil on both of them. So, clean that film off. See that film? You want that off the top of there. We're gonna get that off. And then I'm gonna pour it and I'll be back for part two, which is the canning process.